Shout out to uh, Fox Soul slash um, what TGIF. We're going to get into this whole uh, Carlissa situation with uh, Claudia Jordan, okay? Y'all know they don't like each other, okay? We know that. They do not like each other. And um, it's funny because from the footage that Carlissa shows, she shows something else. But Jason, was, Jason Lee basically... A uh, uh, ban Carlissa from red carpet events, anything to do with Holly, Hollywood Unlocked. Y'all know Hollywood Unlocked got the Impact Awards and got all this. You know, you know, Jason Lee be on his big one. Jason Lee be doing all type of stuff, right? But regardless, he banned her from, you know, all of his events because he said that Carlissa tried to fight Carlissa. I mean, uh, try to fight Claudia Jordan. Okay, she's one of the hosts, or you know, one of the former hosts on the show. Um, TGIF on Fox O with Armand Wiggins, Al, and uh, Claudia, right? Uh, I think Funky Dineva was on the show too. Something like that. That's his name. Um, regardless, Claudia has been throwing jabs at Carlissa for a while now. Okay? Been throwing jabs at Carlissa for a while. And Carlissa's been going back and forth with her. Now, you know, Carlissa about that action though. So, you know, she got that Christian Rock in her. She the original Christian Rock. She the original Unstable Creature. You feel me? So, you know, basically, Carlissa, you know, approached her, if you will. But like I said, from the footage that I saw, it didn't look too bad. But maybe it's not Maybe it's not what we saw. You know what I'm saying? Maybe Jason Lee saw something else. I don't know. But let's get into it. Let's go to where it all started. So, this is Claudia Jordan and the cast of um, TGIF basically dragging... Carlissa to the ground, okay? Okay? Uh, let me post this up for uh, copyright uh, reasons, of course. Let's do this. And let's check it out, guys. Let's check it out. All right, fair use. Fair use. Want to die. Because at this point, that is so embarrassing to have a mother not only be a clout chaser, be slightly, mildly, maybe even attracted to me, but then also bringing cameras to the courtroom, exploiting me, and then gets online making jokes about it. Like, all this. That's weird. He he said Carlissa is attracted to Blueface. Uh, you know, she's been getting a lot of those allegations about them having an Oedipus complex, which is weird. I, I mean, she do got a weird obsession with her son. She said she she remember she said her son got a bigger, you know, privates than her own husband. It's like, girl, how did you know that? Uh huh. You know, it's weird. It's it anyways. Uh let's get into it. Uh Armand drags her, but then uh Claudia goes to work on her too. And obviously Carlissa didn't like that. Let's go. This is for her own album mother that I have because if Carlissa was my mother I would want to die because at this point that is so embarrassing to have a mother not only be a clout chaser be slightly mildly maybe even attracted to me but then also bringing cameras to the courtroom exploiting me and then gets online making jokes about it like all this is for her own algorithmic gain and it's just really weird and it's unfortunate and and I, I feel bad for Blueface. i feel bad for the sister i feel bad for the grandchild i feel bad every for everyone attached to this because as the mother of the family you are the matriarch and you are just as messy as the kids and clout chasing as the kids and it's really weird i'm just so happy that my mom is not like this i heard that Al, what you think about this lady Armand, I'm going to need your help with this. Now, Clarissa Calis Carlissa is on that new reality show over at Zeus, correct? With yes, Tokyo okay. Tony. So, Tokyo Tony. So, let me tell you something. This lady right here knows how to work the internet, and she knows how to work the press. She saw this as an opportunity to, to associate herself, being that her show is up, to associate herself with one of the biggest names in the entertainment industry, and she stepped right into it, and she's getting coverage, not only on the blogs, but on social media and i find it very fascinating like you said that she has learned to do this in such a savvy way that not only has she now landed a reality show which will be paying her but she's now becoming a talking head in the cult in the um pop culture circles yeah it's embarrassing i'm so tired of her 
you know, and listen, I, Zeus going, they're going to capitalize on popularity. Popularity does not mean good or does not mean quality. Carlissa is a hot mess. Um, she is, we've had word of, words on social media and I could give a care less what she says about me because your opinion is not valid to me. I think she's a mess. I think she's very responsible for the dysfunctionality in her relation, in her, in her household, the way she speaks on her son's genitalia and all yeah. the weird stuff she says about the baby. She was talking real bad about that baby. She claims the baby, doesn't claim the baby, has been an awful grandmother. And I hope you see this. Because you ain't going to do nothing when, because you'll never see me out because we will never be in the same circles again. We were once. I just think you're like, you were a pretty girl back in the day, too. Like, back in the 90s, 2000s, I think she said we was in the same circles. No, we weren't. Maybe at a party that she was outside and I was inside. She said she took all your men, you know, 50, Usher, Chris uh, Brown, all them want to hit. No, no, I, no, thought, I think she's, I think she is. I think she will be at the BET Awards. Zeus is bringing out all their top talent for the BET Awards. And so, you know, Claudia, you hold you guys over there. Well, I'll you be presenting. In a similar circle. I'll be presenting. We will be away from the uh, seat filler area. So I'm just saying. <laughs> Yo, they was going in on Carlos, bro. Claudia Jordan do not like Carlissa. But I do remember when they was going back and forth. I think it was last year. Claudia Jordan said something about Blueface. And Carlissa responded. They was going back and forth. She said, we would never be in the same circles. Never. <laughs> hey, that's some funny shit, bro. I already know Carlissa going to say something. She don't want but but you 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 know Carlissa has something to say. You know Carlissa has something to say, y'all, right? So Carlissa responded back to Claudia saying, "Tell Claudia that don't argue with women." Wait, oh, okay. She said, "Tell Claudia that I don't argue with women who have no eggs. We aren't the same. You never know who you're gonna run into out there showing them cheap." You know, cheap ASS houses in Dallas, Miss Claudia. Uh oh. Hey, Claudia got a big old forehead, too, huh? I never noticed that. Hey, hey, Claudia Jordan forehead is insane. Hey, Claudia Jordan look like Roger from um from American Dad. You ever seen American Dad? Y'all know that cartoon? American Dad Roger. You can't tell me. Claudia don't look like uh, Roger with that forehead right here. Like, dang, that that's the first thing that that I that I thought of. You know, Good Morning USA. You know, that, I mean, that's just the vibe that I'm getting. That's the vibe that I'm getting. Okay, just from the forehead. Yeah, she got a five head. I never noticed her forehead was that big. I, I just, my bad, y'all, my bad. Yeah, y'all know I be, I be looking. My bad. I, her, like her head just looked extra long in this picture for some reason. You know, <laughs> and it looks shiny, huh? You know, it don't, it, 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 it's, it's bad that it's like shiny too. She got like a bowling ball head. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, so you know, Carlissa has something to say even more. Okay, so check this out, man. Shout out to uh. Tasha K. All right, check this out. Fair use. Her mouth up real quick when that man said, "Now when she see your black ass on that BET Awards, yeah, she sure. shut the fuck up so quick." Like, girl, I done ran into you on a couple of jobs, and you were standing there trying to host, <laughs> trying to keep your legs up, girl. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that? Some some lady that looked just like <laughs> like she ninety nine already. Yes, Claudia, Claudia. That's what we used to call her back in the day. I don't know why she got such a big voice right now. She, her eggs are fried. She can't have kids because she had that idiot, that Claudia Claudia lady. You know which one? And chill out on that, man. Eggs is fried and died and late. She shut her mouth up real quick when that man said, "Now when she see your black ass on that BET Awards, she shut the fuck up so." quick like girl i done ran into you on a couple of jobs and you were standing there trying to host <laughs> trying to keep your legs up girl <laughs> <laughs> who is that some some lady that looked just like <laughs> like she 99 already <laughs> yes claudia, claudia that's what we used to call her back in the day i don't know she said they call her chlamydia jordan that's funny 
why she got such a big voice right what now. She, her eggs are fried. <laughs> she can't Ransha. have kids because she had that idiot, that Claudia Claudia lady. You know which one. And chill out on that, man. Eggs is fried and died mm -hmm. and late. She shut her mouth up. Okay, so here we go. This leads us to this, okay? So Jason Lee, you know Jason Lee, right? Hollywood Unlocked. He went on his podcast and said straight up, like, Carlissa's ghetto, okay? And she's not invited to any of his events anymore, okay? Because of what she tried to pull uh, at, you know, his show, saying that, you know, she tried to fight Claudia Jordan, okay? Now, this is crazy, y'all. Check this out. Shout out to Stewie the Hunchback. Uh, I'm, I'm guessing this is a channel that don't like uh, uh, Jaden. Uh, shout out to Stewie the Hunchback for the post, all right? It says, karma is slowly catching up with y'all, okay? Fair use. Um, there were a couple hiccups of people who came and decided to behave however they chose to behave. I do want to make an announcement here that Carlissa Southfold is now on that list of individuals who's no longer eligible to be at any Hollywood Unlocked event because she showed up and tried to fight Claudia Jordan. Now, this is not that type of situation. I don't care what network you're on or what type of culture you're a part of, what your house look like or what your upbringing is. If you act like an animal, I'm going to keep you in a cage outside of my event. So when you... Ooh, hey, he, he called Carlissa an animal? Uh, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, she did have her own booyah. Um, I, I forgot all about that, man. Carlissa, man, Carlissa ain't ish, y'all. Carlissa ain't ish, y'all. Like, that's crazy. I, I actually forgot about the booty picture thing. Carlissa is the ultimate clout chaser. Like, for real. Like, that's crazy. There were a couple hiccups of people who came and decided to behave however they chose to behave. I do want to make an announcement here that Carlissa Southfold is now on that list of individuals who's no longer eligible to be at any Hollywood Unlocked event because she showed up and tried to fight Claudia Jordan. Now, this is not that type of situation. I don't care what network you're on or what type of culture you're a part of, what your house look like or what your upbringing is. If you act like an animal, I'm going to keep you in a cage outside of my event. So when you Now, so we got the tea, okay? We got the tea, y'all. Okay, so Carlissa is claiming that it wasn't so bad and basically that Jason Lee is trying to like defame her. He's trying to like, you know what I'm saying? Like treat her basically like treat her like trash. You know what I'm saying? Like she's saying that they got that she thought their relationship was better than that. Uh, I guess he she probably believes that he's probably choosing sides between you know Carlissa and Claudia because from the footage of what Carlissa's trying to show, she's saying that it wasn't what he claims it was because he claimed that she tried to fight uh claudia okay but you guys be the judge all right so look let's go jason lee uh i think you made a mistake when you lied on me again I did not try to fight Claudia Jordan at the Hollywood Unlocked event. I would never do anything that ghetto. I also have receipts of her and I apologize in, uh, in acting like grown women at your event. I will share the footage on my show tomorrow on Six Side. Okay, the fan page. Okay, for however, for whoever. She's saying however. You mean whoever? Hey, Carl, listen, I don't know how to write either. For whoever wants to see uh, how people just live to lie on good people no worries i usually only take my presence where the lord wants me to wants me to bless other good people man she sound like chris Sean. uh thanks for everything and i do believe i'm one of the only million views on your show besides my children uh-oh my real la family blues okay she throwing shots okay okay so let's let, let, let's keep it going all right she claiming that nothing happened, all right? She says, 
We can't trust people in the offices that ban people without due process. Not everyone is uh, fit to serve. Okay. All right. So she got the footage, right? Let me see. So here's the footage. Okay. Let's, um, let's pause that. Obviously. Hold on. She said, do this look like, she said, do this look like I tried to fight or make peace. Okay. It says when your assistant is on uh go just so they can, can't lie on you. Okay. Yeah, that's a good point. I mean, they don't look like they really fighting like that. I mean, they look like they were cordial. I don't know. You guys be the judge. Y'all let me know. Let me see. She got the camera more focused on her. Yeah, so I guess, yeah, they looked like they were kind of like being cool. I don't know. It didn't look that bad. Um, She says, uh, we can hear what was said on the real family blues. The mama don't leave the house without shooters. Uh, basically she's saying she got the camera and she said they banned me from after lying on me, uh, lying on an interview saying I tried to fight Miss Claudia. Yeah, it looked like they was chilling though. Ain't no so she's sitting on her lap and they acting like they cool, right? Yeah, what is she sitting on her lap? Oh no, no, she's sitting down. No, okay, okay, okay. No, she's sitting down and uh Claudia's uh like crouched down. Okay, okay. Cause I'm like, it looked like Carlos was sitting on her lap at first. But regardless, yeah, it looked like they cool. Like I I'm sure I'm I'm thinking that maybe Jason Lee is just tired of her. I'm guessing Jason Lee is just tired of her. That's the kind of vibe that I'm getting. I mean, because it's Jason Lee's event. He can just say he don't want her to be there, but maybe he's just using this as an excuse, you know. But from what I'm seeing. It looked like they acting like they cool. But then again, you know how mean girls can be like, you know, they can talk just like this, but they can actually still be kind of insulting each other and stuff. So I don't know. I don't know. But Carlissa is saying that they're cool. So I don't understand why Jason Lee is pushing the, the narrative that they were that she tried to fight her. So I think I think something happened between Jason Lee and Carlissa. That's kind of what it's given to me. I, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Um, but let's, uh, let, let, let's see what Carlissa has to say about it. Yes, my little feelings was in a bunch. Um, after watching Jason Lee ban me. Um. She says, y'all let my haters convince y'all that I want fame or money. I'm a hidden, unstable weapon. Oh, my God. She says, I'm a hidden, unstable weapon with my own agenda. No, you're an unstable creature. Oh, my God. Yes. Carlissa, no, I wish you would have said creature. No, not unstable weapon. You were almost close. No. You're an unstable creature. You, you are almost there. Close, but no cigar. House full of women, cub. House full of sensitive-ass females. Dealing with they damn hormones. Y'all some unstable creatures. See, I ain't gonna say the B word. I'm gonna say unstable creatures. It's my new word. Okay. But yeah, that's what it says on her story. She says, y'all let my haters convince y'all that I want fame or money. I'm a hidden, unstable weapon with my own agenda. Well, girl, you want fame and money. Why, like, why are you acting stupid? Why are you acting stupid? You said she watches my content. You would be surprised who watched my content. I wouldn't be surprised if Krishan herself watched my content. Zio, they all do. You'll be surprised. You'll be surprised. They be in the clouds. Just because people aren't in your chat room don't mean they not watching. Okay, don't mean they not watching, but yeah, um, I don't know. I'm starting to think maybe Jason Lee just trying to get rid of Carlissa. 
that's really the vibe that I'm getting, you know. Uh, but let, 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 let's see what this unstable creature has to say, okay? Not as a friend, because we're not friends. Not as, you know, a confidant or anything else. But as a politician, mostly, because... From them, you know, especially from our culture and our community, we're looking for due process. You know what I'm saying? That's the only thing that I'm looking for is due process. That's that's all. That's that's what I live for. You know what I? And when a person can't get, at least give you due process, they're not worthy of my presence. They're not worthy of my presence. I don't give a damn if I don't go nowhere else in the industry. Or, or don't get invited to nothing else. All I well, you sound like you care, boo boo. Carlissa, you sound like you care. I'm looking for is due process. That's it. That's all. Okay. Uh, Y'all believe her? Y'all believe her? Let's hear her one more, one more time. Yes, my little feelings was in a bunch um, after watching Jason Lee ban me. Um, not as a friend, because we're not friends. Not as, you know, a confidant or anything else. But as a politician, mostly, because from them, you know, especially from our culture and our community, we're looking for a due process. You know what I'm saying? That's the only thing that I'm looking for is due process. That's that's all. That's that's what I live for. You know what I? And when a person can't get, at least give you due process, they're not worthy of my presence. They're not worthy of my presence. I don't give a damn if I don't go nowhere else in the industry, or, or don't get invited to nothing else. All I'm looking for is due process. Girl, shut up. Um, let, let's see what she got to say. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Get your, get your grandbabies. All right. Um, let's see. Hold on. She says procedural due process refers to the constitutional requirement that when government acts in such a manner that denies a citizen of life, liberty, or property in interest, the person must be given notice, the opportunity to be heard in the decision by a neutral decision maker. I give it, and it's all look, and it's all I look for in return. Girl, shut up. Why is she acting like this? Is like, girl, if he don't want you at his events, he don't want you at his events. Like for real. Like, I don't want to be nowhere that I'm not wanted. That's just how I am, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. I've always been like that. I'm ne I'm never been in the business of uh convincing people to like me of convincing people to want me around okay people i ain't gonna lie y'all it don't matter family or not people are on a lifetime probation with me yes lifetime probation okay it's only takes so many times for somebody to, to, to lie to me cross me off nah you up out of here i'm sorry okay so if you're showing any type of because you know it only gets worse as we get older like your patience is, you know what I'm saying? It's different when you're younger. I only have like leniency for, you know, for kids, you know, like, cause kids go be kids, you know what I'm saying? But like we grown 30s, 40s, 50s, and you lying, backstabbing, you know what I'm saying? Scamming all, no, get the hell out of here. I'm what? Are you serious? You know what I'm saying? Or talking behind my back, don't really want to be around me, being fake, you know what I'm saying? Don't really, I'm, what? Like, what are we doing here? All Jason Lee had to say was that one time, hey, Grape T. Uh, I don't want you at my events no more. You an animal, blah, blah, blah. I, I, okay. You won't see me at your events. You won't even see me bring you up. I, don't, I won't talk about you. I don't do the YouTube beef. You know I'm saying? I don't, like, there's people on YouTube that's talking about me, hating on me, this and that. I don't even give them attention. I don't. Y'all wouldn't even know. Because I don't talk about them. I don't care. I do my job and, and, and get on. This is the internet, y'all. I don't, like, life is life real life you know what i'm saying so i just don't get like the best uh action is no reaction that makes people so mad people making whole live streams about you talking about you this you know what i'm saying just hating i don't respond <laughs> makes them mad 
That's how you make them mad. That's how you make them mad, right? So she giving Jason Lee all this attention because, girl, you care. You care, <laughs> right? So look, she care a lot, y'all. Look, she says, I let my enemy deny her just so I could receive her. I play chess in real life. To God be the glory. Somebody said, damn, I can't believe Bree is a twin. She act like you her twin. I said no at first because she had three children, but she definitely has your front and back. She always know the assignment. God builds our army and they, man, Carlissa and Krishan always bringing up God. They ain't got nothing to do with God. So look, she, she, look, look how petty Krishan, uh, look, I'm calling her Krishan. <laughs> look how uh, petty Carlissa is. All right. Look, look, look how petty they are. She posts Jason Lee's interview with Claudia Jordan. It was over a year ago, right? It had only 339,000 views. That's a lot, though. I'm saying only because it's compared to um, it's compared to Carlissa's interview. All right. So she got 3,000, you know, almost three, what? Almost 350,000, 340,000 views. Right. She says, I rest my case. Look how petty she is. She go post the interview with her and uh, Jason Lee. It got 1.5 million views. OK. It got 1.5 million views, right? Now, Carlissa is very disingenuous. You know why? Because you're acting as if the interview got that many views because of you, okay? All right, let's go back. Check this out. Y'all know I'm. Y'all know this is. I, I, I keep it real over here. I don't care. I don't play no favorites. Claudia Jordan. All right. Is most likely, I mean, she's still talking about other people and stuff, but this is about Claudia Jordan, right? That's probably why I got that many views. Carlissa, you had an interview seven months ago at the height of the circus. And in the, like literally in the, in the title, it says, blue face, a bad son, Jaden Alexis is a narcissist and makes up with Christian Rock. Of course, people go click on that. People want to know what's going on with Blueface, Jaden, and Krishan Rock. Not you. So why are you over here acting like it was about you? I guarantee you, that's like nobody cares about Carlissa. Let's be honest. No, no offense. No offense. It's just we are tuned in to you because of the circus, because of your connection to Junior, allegedly. Because because of your connection to Krishan, Jaden, Blueface. You know what I'm saying? Whack 100 right? Carlissa, you're not interesting. What do you do other than go on live in your bed, in the hot tub, and just run your mouth? Like, what? you know? We only know you because you blue face mama. So let, 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 let's, let's not play dumb here. Let's not play dumb here. Okay? She really, she, you know, she, she, she really making it seem like, you know, it was about her. I guarantee you if that, uh, if this title was called Carlissa Sappho talks about her life and, you know, uh, her next, you know, her next project or something like that, it'll probably be around the same as Claudia Jordan, maybe less, but yeah, let's just say it'd be, it'd be the same. Let's say 300,000. That 1.5 was at the height of the circus. Krishan had the baby. They they fighting going back and forth. Blue face. Yeah, I mean, there was a lot going on seven months ago. Seven months ago, that was uh what December? Yeah, a lot of stuff was going on in the circus. Uh Krishan uh got into it with the, you know, with the Tamar Braggs. It was a lot of stuff going on. The circus was circusing. So that's just my thought, though. You said Claudia paid for that. I'm just saying, I I did she speak the truth about herself though? Uh, I think they all be paying for the uh for the uh for the interviews. Unless it's just a agreement, like for promotion. How you know Carlissa didn't pay for the interview? Um you said she stayed boiling the that seafood platter in that hot. Oh my lord, put a helicopter in the chat. That's disgusting. 
Um, Carlissa, take your grandbabies to daycare and have uh, car yeah, have have several seats. You said Carlissa talks too much. She's a liability because she talks about everybody right. Because she ain't got nothing else to talk about. I have a feeling they're trying to shut down Carlissa's antics. Plus, Jason is also cool with Blueface, Wack 100, Ray J, all people Carlissa has fallen out with. Hey, that's that's a that's a good point. You know, you said, girl, we've been kicked out of better places. <laughs> yeah. You said, what kind of fame is she looking for? Any Any type of fame? But yeah, uh, what's y'all thoughts on this? I, I I just think she was being disingenuous with that, and then and now she going back and forth with people. Don't fight to win the fight to overcome. I knew you weren't trying to fight Claudia. Jason needs publicity. Uh, apologize immediately. Immediately, she said, "I don't try to do nothing. I'm so sorry, but you always come on top. Come out on top, man." Guys, this is Tokyo Tony. Make sure you get over here. Uh oh, yeah, uh, that's that show coming out. I'm gonna be watching it. I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna watch it. I'm gonna watch the first couple episodes. We, we might have to do some reviews, y'all. Y'all wanna y'all wanna review the auntie podcast? <clears throat> we might have to review the auntie podcast because I, I know this show about to be crazy. So auntie's couch. We here with who? Tia, Carlissa, and you don't want to miss the one and only Tokyo Tony. You on your period what okay i might not watch it now i ain't gonna lie I they lost me with that they they, they lost me with that one i, I ain't gonna lie y'all gotta let me know let me know and uh I'll, I'll let you know if we if we review it if y'all want me to review it she said let that apology uh, let that apology be loud as the disrespect jason lee okay and then and, and then of course she go show her grandbabies where junior at Where's Junior at? All right. Anyways, anyways, man, uh, I, I, I'm tired. I'm, I'm tired of Carlissa. Okay, you said no. You don't. You, you don't want to review it. <laughs> um. Yeah, clear the men from the room with that one exactly. Uh, you said who going to uh pay to watch her play with her salmon cake? Oh my lord. He used uh, her for information. Don't need her anymore is what is given. That's a good point. You see, yeah, that show's going to last this one season. It's, it's too many egos. It's too many egos. Sure, let's do it. Okay, you want us to uh, review it? Actually, I don't want to support them. <laughs> uh, he said, seriously, where's Junior? Yeah, yeah that's a good question. Yeah, they're going to be fighting after a week. We'll see. 